Hey there guys, welcome back to Cop Talks and another video. Today's video is gonna be uh, basically just something kind of random. I saw Readiness Reviews had ordered some stuff from varustaleka.com. It's a Finnish military surplus store, and I was kind of curious what all they had. So I ordered a, a couple of small things, which was awesome because they had flat rate $10 shipping to the US, which was just totally in my budget. <laughs> Let's just say that. And I didn't order too much, I just wanted to kind of see what they had and they actually had a few things that I really 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 wanted and I had a really really hard time finding. So first off the first thing I put in my cart was a German Bundeswehr mess kit right so this is a German military surplus silverware kit. So basically you get a can opener, bottle opener, and kind of the holder for all the silverware. You get a nice little knife that's not too bad. I mean, it's no steak knife, but, you know, for MREs and such, not too bad. It'll definitely do the trick. You got a pretty good looking fork here, pretty solid. And all these are marked OFW, which I'm sure is the manufacturer. I didn't look it up. Made in 79 and Bundeswehr, or Bund. So, German military. And we got the spoon here. Pretty pretty good sizable spoon. You could use this for a soup spoon or a regular spoon or whatever. So pretty, pretty happy with that. Everywhere else here, it was about $20. And on their website, it was $10. Granted, this was about $20 with shipping anyway. And I kind of had to wait like two weeks or whatever. Maybe not that long. But I was able to order a few other things that I wanted. And that was some things that I saw on Steve 1989's MRE Info uh, YouTube page. And that was the Shoka Cola. And this is also German, you know, shameless plug for Germany here. But I got the Shoka Cola with Vollmilch, which is whole milk um, chocolate or milk chocolate. And then Zartbitter, which is kind of like um, dark chocolate. You know, it's not super sweet, but not totally, you know, sugarless either. And then uh, I got some ham cock because <laughs> I saw that uh, readiness reviews had ordered some cock and I also wanted some cock. As you can plainly see, this is called ham cock. Now this is supposedly a ham and rye bread sandwich in a can. This label does come off. Um, I can't read shit on here. Oh no, wait. It does say pork in rye bread gut does not contain cock. <laughs> It has an expiration date of 1017 of 2024. Yeah, that's a good that's some good shelf life right there, man. But um I'm gonna be tasting the chocolate. I'm not gonna be opening this, mostly because I'm saving this cock for my secretary. I, I really want her to try some foreign cock, so this is uh, I'm gonna be taking this to work and I'm gonna be letting her sample this this can of cock right here. So we'll just go ahead and put that to the side. And I'm gonna be trying some of this chocolate here. Now, I've already had quite a bit of caffeine this morning and this is supposed to be like energy chocolate so I may not eat an entire piece because I will probably die okay it says hier drucken that means push here it's got like a little dent in there so oh look at that wow it came right open it smells uh it smells just like chocolate there you go. It's all pre-cut, pre-formed. There's two levels of it. So underneath this paper here, there's another disc, if you will. Oh, wow. Wow. Even the dark chocolate. This reminds me so much of Germany. I mean, yeah, it's a German product, but mm, wow. That is actually really good. And that's that's the dark chocolate one. And it's it's not super unsweet, but it's not super sweet either. And this this is the milk chocolate right here. Oh, let me open these both back up again because I'm pretty sure there's a color difference here. Yes, the dark chocolate is in fact darker than the milk chocolate. Ah, it smells like good chocolate. Oh my god. Wow. I'm not a big chocolate guy, right? I don't eat a whole lot of chocolate, but that is that milk chocolate one. This is good. This is an experience. Like, I don't know how to describe that flavor. Like, it's way different than any other chocolate I've found ever. And both these tins were $2.99 each. So I decided to pick them up because everywhere else I saw them for $10, $12 each. I thought, well, shoot, I can get these for $2.99. I'm going to try them. I'm glad I did. Normally, things with caffeine added. Caffeine is an alkaloid, so it's very bitter. Most stimulants are. And this, is, this has added caffeine to it, but there's no bitterness. 
there is no bitterness at all. That is really, really satisfying. Okay, so there is, um, per 100 grams, there's 200 milligrams of caffeine. Holy shit. So this whole thing has 200 milligrams. I think it says this is a 100 gram container. Wound expiration date of April 17th, 2021. Made in Germany. In the back it says, Coca-Cola. this stuff is identically shaped, in identically shaped tins, has kept the Germans awake since the 30s. Coca-Cola is a chocolate with lots of caffeine, essentially a mild combat drug. <laughs> Love it. But yeah, so I got these for about three bucks a piece. Wow, that's awesome. I'm definitely going to put one of these in my go bag. That's a good source of sugar and energy. And uh, just definitely a, definitely a fucking morale boost. That is nice. Gosh, that, I'm probably going to eat. I don't like chocolate. I'm probably going to eat this whole thing. And then, of course, you got the ham cock here. I think I got this for about $5. So this whole thing shipped was like, you got 10 16 Yeah, yeah. I got the whole thing shipped for like 30 bucks stateside for uh, everything you see here. Not too bad. Well, anyway, guys, just wanted to kind of show you my little haul there from Baros de Leca. Um, I'll leave a link to the website down below. They were actually really cool, and I contacted them, kind of asking where my order was and stuff like that, and they got right on it, told me exactly where it was, shipped it via DHL, and got it to me pretty quick. So if you guys are interested, check out their website. Hopefully you find some cool stuff on there just like I did. And Until then, stay safe, be good to each other out there, Definitely have your affairs in order, and have a fantastic day, and I will catch you in the next one.